Welcome to the latest update program. In this series, we will discuss what is TVS 2M nuclear fuel. Russia has supplied the first batches of nuclear fuel, the TVS 2M nuclear fuel to India. The fuel has been supplied for the two functioning units of the Kudankulam nuclear power plant that is KNPP. These units of KNPP are powered by VVER 1000 reactors. The VVER is a pressurized water reactor that is PWR that employs light water as a coolant and moderator. Significantly, VVR is the commonest type of nuclear reactor worldwide. Now let's discuss about TVS 2M nuclear fuel. It contains gadolinium oxide which is mixed with UO2 that is uranium dioxide. This mixing is done by different GD densities and U235 enrichments. The core does not contain BARs that is burnable absorbers rods. Once the new TVS 2M fuel is used in the next refueling, the reactor will start operations within an 18 month fuel cycle. TVS 2M fuel assemblies have a large number of advantages making them more reliable and cost efficient. TVS 2M fuel features are increased uranium capacity. One TVS 2M assembly contains 7.6% more fuel material as compared to the earlier fuel bundles. The rigidity of a bundle makes it more vibration resistant. New generation anti debris filter ADF2 protecting bundles from debris damage. Operation in longer fuel cycles also enhances the economic efficiency of a plant as reactors have to undergo stoppage and refueling less frequently. Now information about KKNP that is Kudankulam nuclear power plant. It is situated in Kudankulam in the Tirunelveli district of Tamil Nadu. It is the largest nuclear power station in India. Construction on plant began on 31st March 2002 but faced several delays due to opposition from local fishermen. It is scheduled to have 6 VVER 1000 reactors with an installed capacity of 6000 megawatt of electricity. The first stage consisting of power units number 1 and number 2 was commissioned in 2013 and 2017 respectively. Power units number 3, 4 and number 5, 6 are the second and third stages. Currently power units 3, 4, 5 and 6 are under construction.